This invasion has many leaders worried about a possible cyber attack against the United States. And now USF is getting major money to teach a new generation of students how to fight a new kind of war. ABC Action News reporter J.J. Burden here with the story. According to cybertalk.org, data breach costs went from $3.86 million to $4.24 million in 2021, the highest it's been in 17 years. Cybersecurity experts say there's a very real possibility that more cyber attacks are on the way because of the war between Russia and Ukraine. National security threat that we are facing uh, is real. Uh, there is very high demand for critical skilled labor in the space. And that's what makes Governor Ron DeSantis' big announcement today at USF's Centers for Cybersecurity crucial. We are proud to announce today an additional $20 million to create new opportunities for Floridians in the field of cybersecurity. The money will be used to expand cybersecurity programs, train teachers, purchase equipment, provide more training opportunities for college students, and the center will partner with Bay Area high school and middle schools to train students there as well. And DeSantis says Florida is the first state to provide this kind of opportunity to middle school students. So that's a really big deal. You're putting uh, students in positions to be able to get skills that are going to be immediately in demand. To give you an idea of the demand, there are 22,000 open cybersecurity positions in Florida alone. The Florida International University is getting a grant as well, and there's a third school that will be added, according to the governor. He hopes to get the ball rolling on all of this by the start of the new school year. And J.J. Burton, ABC, Action News.